friends i'm back here to discuss one more important topic okay that is about the classification of studies okay so we know that the studies are classified into three main types one is the descriptive second one is analytical and third one is experimental okay the first one is descriptive so so descriptive basically helps in formulating a hypothesis okay descriptive basically helps in formulating a hypothesis whereas the second one that is analytical basically helps in testing the hypothesis and the last one is a very simple that is well known as experimental experiment means you are going to do an experiment you are going to do an experiment or a study which helps in confirming the hypothesis okay which helps in confirmation of hypothesis so let's learn clearly the main aspect of descriptive study is formulating the hypothesis the main aspect of analytical study is testing that formulated hypothesis and the main aspect of experimental studies is confirming the hypothesis which is tested okay so they are related formulating testing and confirmation i hope you are very clear so we are going to talk about each and individual subtype is already we are already done with this so which studies they comes under analytical analytical the following studies are going to come under analytical one is cohort study there are many other names okay cohort study is also called as follow up study the second one is the case control study is also called as case reference study the third one is cross sectional study cross sectional study is also called as prevalence study and the fourth one is ecological study ecological study is also called as correlation ship study correlation study so uh, again the most commonly asked question at this area is they are going to ask the individual unit in each study so if you talk about the individual unit either in the cohort study or case control study or cross sectional study the individual unit is an individual an individual whereas in the ecological study okay in the ecological study or the correlation study the individual unit is a population the next comes is the different types of experimental studies so the different types of experimental studies are your rct that is randomized controlled trials or your clinical trials or uh, your field trials or your community trials all these they comes under the experimental study the very simple question uh, is which of the following is an analytical study which of the following is an experimental study is a most common and an individual uh, or or an easy question that is asked all of the following are experimental studies except so such simple questions are regularly asked in the examinations okay so i hope where you are very clear the descriptive studies they talk about formulating the hypothesis analytical study they they talk about the testing the hypothesis and experimental studies they talk about confirming the hypothesis okay so when you talk about studies nowadays uh, they're going to give a scenario and they're going to ask which study it is or what study it is used or they're going to give a scenario and they can ask you which of the following study is the best for this particular study or uh, these are the regular questions they are asking in the examination so among the list okay among the list as many of you including you me or anyone we are more familiar with the case control and the cohort studies okay case control and cohort studies are most familiar and of course experimental studies are again the most commonly asked but most of your questions will be around the cohort study case control study and the experimental studies you may get confused uh, what to be opted so it is better you learn a good number of n number of examples or n number of conditions or by just analyzing the analyzing the case whether the case is moving forward or the case is moving backward so basing upon which you can easily differentiate whether it's a cohort study or a case control study with the given data in a particular question which we will be learning in the next level okay so most of your questions will move around a cohort study 
case control study few questions on cross sectional studies and all these uh, the the experimental studies are very very important in examination point of view okay uh, i'll be discussing uh, each and every aspect or every study with some examples uh, in further videos in the class okay so for now signing off from team mds concord